guys um welcome back today is day three of the tome topple challenge and i just thought i would check in with my face since i actually did something with it today so i don't look like trash so it's day three i have some editing ideas that i'm gonna be trying out so we'll see how they work out but i am currently working on strange the dreamer by laney taylor as you guys have seen what page am i on i am on 81 and i really am enjoying it so far but i can see where some people say it's too fluffy like there's way more description than necessary i don't think that's the case at all but there were a few times where i was like eh, like trucking along doing fine and then something exciting would happen and i'm like really caught up in it but so far I'm really loving it and I also forgot the audiobook that I'm listening to like when I can't read so when I'm cleaning or walking the dog um, it is a tome so I'm going to count those I'm sorry if you can hear all the noise my kids are I mean they're playing nicely at least so we're just gonna have to deal with it but um that book is a discovery of witches and it is a massive book so I'm gonna check out the physical copy so I can still tally how many pages I listen to um, and some people hey hey some people don't think that that it counts but the original creator of the tome topple challenge says it does so right now I'm going to eat lunch and get back to reading because I've done my adulting for the moment uh, when Andrew gets home we have to go to the store to get Claire's um, school uniform and stuff like that but I've done all my cleaning now and the kids are fed and happy <laughs> so they're playing Xbox for a while and I'm going to enjoy my lunch finally yes and then uh, well I'm gonna eat and read because I'm a rebel and I'm sitting on the couch doing it so shh don't tell anyone yeah it looks like I'm a floating head mm, no I've got like six chins <laughs> okay so I will check back in later oh hello Papa Roo let me show you how cute he is Look at that face. I could just eat it. Um, um, nom, 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 nom. Hi, Baba. Oh, goodness. Oh, I love you. You're so silly. So, here is my lunch. Yeah, it's a pepperoni and cheese sandwich on a Hawaiian bread. Plus some grapes. Yeah, I am trying to lose weight. Um, and a sandwich isn't like the healthiest thing, but as long as I can fit it into my... Not macros, I'm not doing that. My calories then, that's fine by me. And I ate really healthy this morning, hump ups. Yeah. Anyway, so I am trying out a different vlog style. I watched a few vlogs from Read with Cindy and I love how she does like snippets of her day outside of reading and stuff with a voiceover. So like, you know what's going on, where they're at and stuff. So that's why you haven't seen me yet on this vlog. And if it turns out terrible, I'll never do it again, but. I love her style, and so I'm gonna do that, but I still wanted to vlog and talk to you guys, so. That's a really long clip for not very much bookish information, so I am sorry, but let's see how much we can read before the children get bored and need to come, you know, attack me, and or before Andrew gets home. We'll see which happens first, so let's go read. Are you ready to read? No. What are you? Oh. Oh. Pepperoni? Do you want a pepperoni? I got some treats for you, Papa. Do you want a treat? Hmm? You want a treat? <gasps> Who wants a treat? Oh, goodness. So I thought I needed. 
Did I? Mm -hmm. right. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. We have just wrapped up Tome Topple Readathon, and so I am going to be wrapping it up. <laughs> I got the blood one. Kai wants to help, I guess, in his underwear. Sorry, I blocked that. So I did not do as well as I'd hoped, but we got this one. Kai, can you sit down? They don't want to see your undies, silly boy. <laughs> He's gonna show you my Karen Slaughter book that I'm reading next. And you got this one, and we got the that's this one too. Look at this back. Look at this. Can okay, mommy talk for a minute? My turn. Okay. Not about this. I'm gonna talk about this one first. Okay. So I didn't do as well as I had like hoped I would, but I still did like decent. I feel very content with what I've accomplished. I thought it was a full two week well, readathon, too. but it was not. It was only like eight or nine days so closer to a week but in that time i did manage to read strange the dreamer and it is 532 pages and it's left with a cliffhanger which i so now i'm like trying to find the library book of muse of nightmares which is the next installment of this because our library does not have it here the navy library probably does but we have not made our way down there it takes like 40 minutes to get there so next weekend we're going so if i can't find it on overdrive i will be looking at naval library next weekend so stranger dreamer is a book that it follows two main characters and of course like a bunch of other little secondary characters and this one got five pages. yeah Sorry, I ran out of space on my other one. Let's see if this works better. So this follows Laszlo Strange, who was an orphan and who was originally raised by monks, but then he was delivering a message and gets taken into this library. And that's where he works as a librarian and falls in love with reading and books and does his own research about this lost city that they don't know much about. He's just like, pulling pieces together from little mundane research that he finds in books that no one thinks have any value. We just have to read, we read this. And then there is Sarai, who is the muse of nightmares. She's a main character. And they end up meeting in his dreams. And they get to know each other and all that stuff. So I did, I don't want to like say too much more because I don't want to like spoil it. And what I've said now isn't really spoilery because I'm pretty sure I saw that stuff on Goodreads. But I gave this 5 out of 5 stars. And like I said, I am trying to find Muse of Nightmares. Like, I don't really want to buy it because I don't own the first oh, one. I may end up just buying both of them if I can find both of them. Because I do love these this book. Um, do I love it enough to own it? I love this Maybe. book. Maybe. I like this book like really times. You love that book? Mm-hmm. <laughs> so I started Tome Topple as a vlog, but I'm going to be honest with you, I kind of fell off the vlogging wagon about Saturday or Sunday, which is fine. It's only like three days early, but I'm going to include the footage I have. For five days. Yeah, the footage I have from it and kind of make this another island life vlog with reading included obviously so 540 that isn't it oh my gosh i'm crazy i forgot i read or i listened to three hours of a discovery of witches and i cannot remember the author's name right now so i'll just put it on the screen um we got that this. book we got this one we all ready and it's my turn it's my turn now oh and that book was good too i'm only going to give it four out of five stars I don't know. I'm going to continue the series because I canceled my Audible subscription. Hang on. 
after I got all of them with my remaining credits and well, I just hope I like it more. Maybe a three out of five. At first I loved it because it follows a witch who is in love with a vampire and it was really interesting, but the main character is now kind of getting on my nerves. Like she's super, I don't know how to explain, like clingy and I don't know. I'm just not really vibing with her, but that's okay. We're gonna continue the series. So I did 532 pages of a book and three hours of an audible book. And I couldn't find a physical copy of that book at the library, so I don't know the page count. But I'm still counting it because the book is like 600 pages and three hours is a long time to invest in anything. So, thank you for watching, right? Mm -hmm. Thank you for watching. I did record my bullet journal for April, but I'm, stop it. I'm not going to put it up because... Um, well, April is like pretty much done. And so today I'm recording May and it will be up next week for sure. Um, but yeah, so make sure you like this video if you enjoyed it, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye! What do you say? Bye! Say bye-bye. Bye-bye. Finch, 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 finch. Finch, finch, finch.